This production is about the SSGN nuclear powered guided missile submarine Echo 2. Echo 2 SSGN with two pairs of SSN 312 missile tubes in the elevated position. There's the conning tower. There's the uh, firing platform for the the missiles. And here's part of the back of the submarine. There's another example here. An Echo 2 SSGN in the Pacific. The mast at the after end of the sail structure folds back into a deck recess when not in use. This is the front. Back. This is another good image. A close up of an Echo 2 SSGN in the North Atlantic. The broad face of the sail structure covers the front doors. Front door radar used for guiding the SSN 312 anti ship missiles. See, there's um, a set of missiles here here, here, and here. And these holes are like backdraft sockets. Builders. Komsomolsk, Severodvinsk, Displacement, 5,000 tons surface, 6,000 tons submerged. Length, 377 feet 2 inches. Beam, 29 feet 6 inches. Draft, 24 feet 7 inches. Propul propulsion, steam turbines, 30,000 sh ship horsepower, 2 shafts, 4 bladed propellers. Reactors. Two pressurized water. Speed, 20 knots surface. 23 knots submerged. Complement, about 90. Missiles, 8 SSN-3A Shattuck anti-ship or 8 SSN-12 Sandbox anti-ship. ASW weapons, torpedoes, six 21-inch torpedo tubes forward, four 16-inch torpedo tubes aft, radars, front door, front piece, snoop slab, sonars, Phoenix, low frequency. These were the Soviet Navy's primary anti-carrier submarine during the 1960s and 1970s. They are the definitive Shaddock armed SSGNs, evolving from the Echo 1 and Juliet SSGN designs. About 15 of these submarines were refitted to fire the improved SSN 12 by 1986. The Echo 2 SSGNs were built in about equal numbers by the Komsomolsk and Severodvinsk yards. All of the five Echo 1 class. SSGNs were built at Komsomolsk. The active units are assigned to the Northern and Pacific fleets. Two SSGNs have been decommissioned and are apparently in reserve. So um, I'm going to stop reading. I hope you enjoyed this production about the Echo 2.